so I'm going to show you how to play RuneScape on your tablet. This works on all tablets, Blackberries, Androids, a a Apple tablets, I suppose. Um, okay, so first of all, what you're going to need to do is go to your App Store um, and download this app. It's called... It is called Splash Top. It's right there. Uh, so click on that. So when you've downloaded it, I think it costs 99 cents. I'm not sure though. So download it. Um, and then obviously you'll have this screen, but you won't have this screen because I already have it, but um, because I've already done this before. So what you want to do is you want to uh, go to the computer, uh, go to your actual PC, and I'll show you what to do there. So just, just after you've downloaded that app, just leave the tablet and go to the PC. Alright, so I'll show what to do on the PC now. Alright, so uh, now that we are back, now that we're at the PC, sorry, uh, I'll show what to do. So we go to your web website, I suppose, uh, your browser, sorry, uh, so I'm obviously using Chrome, so go to your browser, and go to this website, www.splashtop.com, here we go, so go to that site, and now uh, you'll find this, and go get streamer, click on this thing that says here, get streamer, click, click on that, and then we'll start downloading it, and I'm going to cancel it, because I already have it, but um, cancel that, Oh, no, don't cancel it, download it. <laughs> well, about download it. Uh, then you'll have it installed. Oh, well, then install it, obviously. Go to it, open it. Uh, you can change your computer name uh, and just, yeah, ensure that it's always running, I suppose, and you can always auto launch. Uh, so then your mobile device can always find it. Um, so, yeah, uh, I don't think there's really anything else that needs to be done here. Alright, now that you're back from the PC, you should uh, open up Splashtop again and uh, let it load. And it should say, it should show you this one. Well, it should show your PC. I'm, I'm Mac PC, obviously, but if your name is uh, John Bith or something, in, or whatever your name's, whatever your PC's name is, it should uh, come up here. So it's came up here, you uh, you click on it. Uh, you obviously make a password. You make a password in the, I'll just show you make a password. You go to settings, actually, you click on this little arrow here and uh, you go security code right here so um, obviously I have a security code, I've saved it so um, but you can't see it, but that's my security code uh, so make it anything you want, it doesn't matter and then when you click on it, you type in your password so you type it in click OK it's connecting to my computer and OK, so let's go, let me just close that Alright, as you can see, I already opened up RuneScape. So basically, it's it's well, it's not really like running RuneScape client. It's just um, so this is my actual desktop. It's actually like mirroring your desktop to your um, tablet, and it works all around the house. But you've got to make sure your computer's on. Uh, so anyway, so I'll show you what to do. So I'll show you how well RuneScape works. Because I'm actually surprised it works really, really well. See so you. Let's open up RuneScape here. And that's its loading configuration, just the same way, you know, you run our own thing. You can do this without a, because uh, obviously I'm using a Bluetooth keyboard and a Bluetooth mouse. Um, no, hold on, wait, it's already open in here. Um, uh, it's, no, it's, I don't need that, go away. Yeah, so as you can see, it's not very, um, like, the actual thing works nicely, like, you can type and stuff, but, uh, it can be a bit laggy. It's got, like, a, a bit of a ping. It's not working very well today. Hold on. Alright, well, we'll just try again, I suppose. Alright, let's open it up. So, we'll, we'll try again. I don't know. It screwed up last time. This is learning application. Oh, again, what the hell is this? Alright, well, I'm going to be back when it starts working. So, hold on a second. I'll just, I'll, I'll, I'll get it working. One second. Alright, so RuneScape loaded. Alright, so RuneScape loaded. Uh, so, we're just going to log in. I'll just log in.
Alright, so let's just choose a world, I suppose. Um, let's go world. Now, uh, let's do, I don't know, world. Uh, I don't know, world 21. Alright, let's go world 21. Okay, and uh, so we've logged on. As you can see, you can walk around. It's not. I'll I'll zoom in a bit for you. And also, if you don't want to use a uh, a keyboard and mouse, which is highly recommended to actually play it properly, you can actually use your finger, and you can actually like touch like that, and you know play like that. And uh, talking, it all it all works. Everything works fine. Like it's it it, it doesn't even have that much of a lag. I mean, you can even talk and be like. Yay for playing RS on a tablet. So you know, and you can walk around. You can, and so I'll, I'll just show you what it's like to play it with your fingers, I suppose. So um, and you can go here, I suppose. And, and if you want to talk, uh, you oh, this is on the playbook. You uh, you uh, I'll zoom out a bit. You you swipe up here, and it brings up your keyboard. And it's also got your arrow keys up here, so you can do it completely without a keyboard. Although this doesn't work very well. I've noticed it's a bit laggy. So for example, whenever you click this, it's sort of really laggy. But you can type that. Like you can go hi, click enter, and wait. Hold on. Um, so you go enter and then hi. Oh, and then it goes. Uh, yeah, obviously it doesn't work very nicely with this, but uh, hold on, let's just minimize this little ability bar here. And we'll try again. So we go like this, and then you go just like uh, hi. You click enter. 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 Hi. No, no, I don't want. Yeah, so there we go. So it said it. <laughs> but yeah, no, it doesn't work very well with touchscreen, obviously. But. Use this mouse. Yeah, as you can see, it it works works decently. I mean, you can still you can trade with people. You know, you can go to your friends' chat. You can talk to people. Oh, PowerPoint opened. Um, you can just you know you can even you can go to the Grand Exchange and this like honestly I don't I don't really know what you would use this for like ever. Um, because well. You can't really boss on it. I mean, you could boss, I suppose, or you could go like PKing or like stuff like that, but it's quite laggy, so you probably wouldn't really do that. But I suppose if you want to chill in the GE and just like, I don't know, check your offers or something while on a tablet, you can, um, you can do that. And, uh, well, at least it works. I mean, you know, and it certainly works a lot better because I've seen other methods on YouTube that use like TeamViewer and stuff, and that's quite a bit laggier. Like, honestly, like it's not this smooth. Like, when you click here, it doesn't go there. It sort of just waits a little while and goes there. But uh, as you can see, well, it, uh, you know, everything you can you can equip everything. This isn't a video. You know, this is all playing on actual tablet. Um, it's all real. So they just like just have to go to places. And it also works for other things as well. So you can run like you can play like Minecraft on it and stuff as well. Um, you know, if, if, for example, you're using a playbook like me and it doesn't actually have Skype, you can just, you know, you can go to use Skype. Well, that's not really practical since you need to be next to your computer at all times. But, uh, yeah, at least it works. I mean, it's just a cool feature. I, mean, I don't know when you'd ever use it practically, but I guess to show off the features of your tablet, uh, it's quite cool. Yeah. So I suppose if you want to check your G offers on the go, um, feel free to do that. Alright, well, uh, thanks for watching, and uh, if you liked it, uh, just, I don't know, comment, rate, and subscribe. Alright, thanks. Bye.